Weather briefing for Saturday, February 2, 2019 at 22 UTC. Current weather for airport, Echo. Delta. Delta. Tango. Temperature, 1 degrees Celsius, 33 degrees Fahrenheit. Dew point, 0 degrees Celsius, 32 degrees Fahrenheit. Winds, west-southwest at 8 knots. Weather, rain. Visibility, 2 statute miles. Altimeter, 1,004 millibars, 29.65 inches. Sky, overcast at 300 feet. Okay, so here we are. This is it. Leg Welcome number to 172 and 2 exit degrees, 8 knots, one way, uh, 2 6 left, clear for takeoff, bye bye, and flat. Clear for takeoff, 2 6 left, uh, left number 172, thank you. So we're taking off 2 6 left here at Berlin Teagle, and we're taking Mission the. Mission 187 behind departing uh, company Airbus F320, one way 2 6 left, line up and wait behind. Line up and wait behind the company 320, runway 26 left, Lufthansa 187. So that's, uh, as I was saying, Johnny in front of us, about to line up and take off from the runway. We'll see if we can get the takeoff. And this is it. Uh, this is very exciting, so. So, as we're about to enter the runway here. Sure, that's not right. There goes Johnny. Final flight. European tour. Leg number 10. We've switched back to our Lufthansa buses. So I've got Mr. Five Star Hansa. India Zulu X-ray right now. A room full of doggies and a lovely flight ahead of us. So I'm just gonna line up here. And off he goes. Destination Frankfurt. Okay. Do a final check. Make sure everything's set here. So the ground spoilers, flaps, engine mode is normal. We've got our weather radar. Wind shears on, the squawk box is squawking, we've got all of our navigation lanes, flight directors, everything is set up. So we're just waiting for the ATC command to go. Listen, the 187 wind 280 degrees, 8 knots, 1 way 0 at uh, left, at uh, 26 left, of course, uh, cleared for takeoff, bye bye. Cleared for takeoff, Latanza 187, thank you so much. 
positive rate and gear up. And goodbye, Teagle. Nose up. Elevator trim up. Autopilot. Nose taxi light. Runway turn off light. weather creating something. Hopefully it doesn't slam me out of the sky. Love a climb. Climb up to 280. Assuming we're now done with tower. So, uh, Disengaged. So just go over to Unicom. Okay, so we are out. And there is Tower at Frankfurt, so unless something else pops up, that'll be our next ATC. So, uh, data flaps up. Passing through 4,000, 250 knots is the speed that we're headed for. 280 is where we're headed. Uh, Johnny ahead, now he's disappeared off my TCAS again. That's, uh, that's a a problem through this whole tour. I've always had problems trying to maintain being able to see John on the... Uh, and then sometimes, like, you can flick the direction. So, like, if I set it above... Which is not going to do, it's very weird. So some lessons we've learned from this um, from this series is um, Airbus, or at least the FS Labs Airbus. Um, not a big fan of Iveo traffic. It is uh, just doesn't want to keep things on the on the TCAS. So that was one thing, and uh, very sensitive rudders on these things. Very very sensitive and. Um, but uh, all in all, a really good aircraft. If I had um, better horsepower of a computer behind it to run it, it'd probably fly a lot better for me. But uh, all in all, we've had some really good landings with this, so I've been reasonably happy for the tour for this. We had um, 10 legs, 10 legs total. So I'll go over the list really quickly. So the first leg, we had departed from Frankfurt earlier this week. We went to Edinburgh. We went Edinburgh to Munich, Munich to Toulouse, Toulouse to Dusseldorf, Dusseldorf to Malpanza or Milan, uh, Milan to Cologne, Cologne to Berlin, Berlin to Palma, Palma back to Berlin, and here we are, number 10 is uh, Berlin to Frankfurt, a very quick hop and a skip in the bus here, so. Um, very much looking forward now that we're done this uh, series to get back into um, the bigger Boeing birds, so. Um, actually kind of itching to get into the 777 right now and um, pick up our 777s that we have over in uh, Brazil right now and continue with uh, that mini tour that uh, Johnny and I were doing. It wasn't like an official tour, it's just like, a, hey, let's go here, here, and here, and then come back. So uh, that's going to be some nice flights coming up, so hopefully some content for the Fly With Me series. We um, also have the 748s uh, in the Middle East, so... Um, that's like a nice four-hour flight that I might be able to try and fit in sometime this week. But that's it, and the grand prize of this tour, hopefully when I click the buttons when I'm done, which I'll show a screenshot, is um, the LH-EW Euro Tour Completed Pilot Badge, so it'll show up on my um, pilot page. So, uh... Really good tour, all in all, and I uh, hope uh, some people, while the tour is still on, will uh, will attempt to take it. If not, uh, I'd be glad to hear any suggestions that uh, anyone might have that would uh, be for a tour that they would like to do. You know, we try to keep in the confines of, okay, it has to be the Lufthansa uh, group, so it could be... 
Lufthansa, it could be Lufthansa Cargo, it could be Eurowings, Swiss, um, um, German Cargo or Aerologic, um, any of those companies where we have routes for, and they don't even have to be routes that already exist, but if they're routes that exist in real life and you just want to, you know, send us a quick text, it's like, hey, go, blah, 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 then, yeah, we'll be, uh, be glad to try and put that together and uh, make some something fun out of it, so. And all in all, a, um, a really good set of flights, so it was different. Absolutely different to do this. side shots, we get some beauty shots, we get rid of Iveo here, and you can see the moon right there, it's a little crescent moon right now. This might look like a lot of white blocks, but uh, that's cool. Uh, again, for this flight, like, um, like my previous flight from uh, Palma into um, Berlin there, I decided to go uh, not real time because uh, 6 o'clock Eastern right now is going to be about 11 o'clock at night UTC. So, and I'm just sick and tired of recording uh, in the dark. So I decided to run real weather, but uh, not real time. Keep an eye on the map here. Johnny's still dead ahead of me. Frankfurt Tower is online. Arrival 25 left and right, departure 18 and 25 center, so I'm assuming we're going to do 25 left. Nope. 25 right, Kira 3 Lima, kill MTR. But hold on, wait a minute. Yeah, okay. 25 right, Johnny, taking the baby runway. Okay, that's what we'll do. Maybe we'll let our passengers get up for the few minutes for a cruise here. So that's all off. So, Echo Delta Delta Fox arrival. We set 2 5 right. We're gonna do right Yankee. Kira 3 Lima. Insert and kill MTR, which I agree. I don't understand this MTR VOR. It's always a uh, in the way. Chuck a routing. So flight plan down to twenty. Turn it. Kirax Jed. That's pretty anti faff I'd say. So Mr. Johnny might have to redo this flight. He uh, loaded the ACAR software but didn't realize that it pulled the prior flight. happens, it's a thing, that's, you know, what you get with ACAR software. It'd be cool to see the future of airplanes with um, the sim and, um, like, you hear about the things like PMDG Global Flight Ops or the Project Fly and things like that. Like, it'd be cool if it could just, like, go right into the ATC system of the airplane that, like, takes off and locks your flight for your airline, but I think we're still a ways off from that. Sorry, I have to do this, but we need 
to make absolutely sure this little guy pops up the landing rate. So back to arc. Getting close to our planned flight level. We got another 7,000 feet to climb. That was too bad. There was a lot of ATC earlier, but again, it's like about 11, 12 o'clock in, uh, uh, in Europe right now, so... We shall see. But yeah, no one, um, no one's online, unfortunately, at the moment, other than a couple towers, which is great. You know, at least there's still some towers online, people trying to hang out to let as much flying go on as possible. It is always neat on a weekend when, um, you look at, um, the uh, Iveo web eye and like the map is just colored like crazy all sorts of stuff going on different areas like it's a very heavy presence in Europe Brazil and um, in the Middle East so uh, it's pretty cool So descending through 22.1, 340 knots or Mach 758 and slowing. Let's set uh, the auto brakes very, well it's a shorter runway but I, I feel confident we can get it in on auto brake low and stop in time before having to do a crazy taxi back around. now. Make it 
screen now. We'll probably have to do a, an orbit of some sort here. But let's ignore him for a wing view for a second to hear our pursuer tell people to sit down. Meine Damen und Herren, wir beginnen nun mit unserem Landeanflug. Bitte achten Sie darauf, dass Ihr Handgepäck sicher verstaut ist und überprüfen Sie, dass Ihr elektronisches Gerät im Flugmodus ist. Alle Sendfunktionen müssen ausgeschaltet sein. Ladies and gentlemen, we are starting our approach. Please make sure that your hand baggage is safely stowed and that your portable electronic device is switched to flight mode. All transmission functions must be switched off completely. Orbit time. Time. Ah, the joys of flying without ATC. circle above me. <coughs> this little go around now has a uh, Uh, taken away from, uh, from our ability to see Johnny, which is, uh, which is unfortunate. Let's go direct to Delta Oscar 56 Romeo. Keep that turn going. Slow down my descent rate as we're well below profile now. Have a look at that map. Okay, that's made that really nice and pretty now. So there's a good uh, at least 20 miles of spacing now. Maybe. Lufthansa 542, that's going Hamburg to Frankfurt. He might file himself in between Johnny and I. I 
shows up there, but does not show up here. Hmm. Okay, let's uh, continue with the approach. Pay attention to what's going on here. So that was a rather interesting, uh, interesting thing. So that plane that's showing up on my T-cast, uh, uh, 1,100 below me, I think this is the Latanza 542 from Eham, and I think he's lining up for the uh, 25 left, or 25 center, I hope. Otherwise, uh, in the interest of making this movie forever, we're gonna... Someone's requesting clearance in Unicom. <laughs> right. At least it's like 10, so we should be okay. I'll just uh, follow in behind uh, this guy. We'll announce our intentions. Okay, so we're about to pass through 10,000. Magenta Dawn is catching up to us. So let's fire on some lights. Everyone's told to sit down. Let's do the approach checklist, please. Approach checklist brought to you by Inri. Minimum set 200 both sides. We have engine mode selector is set to normal and the electronic flight bag is up on the screen. Johnny's on final, he's number one. Latanza 542 is just some random stranger. He's number two, and I am number three right now. So I'll try to keep space and I'll keep that video version of uh, TCAST up on my screen. Now he's disappeared off that. Come on, really? That's not annoying at all. Speed, managed alt. I might manually slow down again so we never into the back of the second guy. Johnny's crash landings at European Tour. Well, my brother, your uh, definition of a crash to landing is a little bit different, I think, than the rest of the world. I think if, um, if you get the airplane on the ground in the center line in the touchdown zone, that counts, and then you're not supposed to focus on your landing rate. But, I mean, obviously you don't want to land at 400. 
Um, 250 is uh, okay, it's a little bit of a bounce, but you know, the airplane can take it. Uh, you really always want to aim for, there's that guy again, you always want to aim for 160. That's uh, what we're supposed to be aiming for, but. Uh, where's this guy? He's 10 miles, okay. Set 1004, both sides. And we're going to slow down here. Actually, I know we're going to go in approach mode early. It's stupid, but it's what I got to do. So activate approach phase, confirm approach phase. Just because I don't want to slam into this guy. Once we slow down, we'll take flaps one. I'm sorry, I hit the microphone, I just felt that. in there, okay, so finally showing up on mine so I can get rid of this thing. 45 minutes of recording. 40 some odd minute flight. We're way off our profile too. Speed check flaps one. Visibility is negligible. And Rex is going to actually update that for me. I see Johnny's there on final. I don't know if I'll be able to capture him though, unfortunately. So there's 319 in front of me. Sorry, Johnny, we won't get your landing on this one. Okay, localizer's coming in. Approach mode, please. Approach mode is active, so hopefully we'll capture the glide. Uh, cat one. miles to run, less. Got a nice little crosswind, 27 knots from left to right, so that's going to make this interesting. That's why that little red number is dancing around on my windscreen, is that the airplane is, uh, Star glide slope. Down we go. Flaps two. Speed checked. If we can end this uh, particular series without a big slam into the ground or weird type of approach, I think I'll be very happy. Ending the series period is, is also a good thing, but uh, after this I got some video editing to do. So the airplane has almost a 7 degree correction right now to the left uh, for, the, for the crosswind. Now looking at my EFB, which I still can't see Johnny on my screen, but it looks like he is pretty much touching down now. So good for you, good sir. Congratulations on a tour well done. 
At this particular second, I'll flash your landing rate on the screen. Wow. I'll leave 5,000 set for us to go around. Zoom in to 10. And we still got almost 9 nautical miles to run. So let's set some of the settings here. So we're going to arm the speed brake. We are going to check that. That's all good. We're still flaps two, flaps three shortly. Lights are on, passenger signs are on. We are two degrees. 2,500. Soup. 2,500, so radio altimeter alive. And I don't think we'll pick up any icing. At a minimum, we're in the. Um, the 320, so I'm not too worried. So I'm just entering the approach zone now. That guy is on a two mile final ahead of me, and Johnny's vacated. Two thousand. three and gear down. Be happy after the recording to take these out of my ears. Like landing gears down, flaps full. Speed checked. Thirteen thousand feet. Some of the scenery is starting to load in down on the left there, so we're going to be visual for this ruler runway. Why did my autopilot and auto throttle come off? Um, hello? <laughs> okay, so we're doing this manual. One thousand. Weird. All right, so we put the autopilot back on. Runway's vacated. Okay. We're probably just going to take this thing off once we get visual here. Huh. Weird. Weird. I'm ready for my Boeings. Oh, you know what? That might have been a wind shear, maybe. Now the wind's coming from behind me all 500. of a sudden. Weird. Okay, here we go. 400. We're too high. 100 above. 100 above. Two minimum. Spike. Minimum continue. One hundred. Fifty. Forty. Thirty. Twenty. Retard. Retard. Ten. Five. Oh, 254. That's okay, I'll take it. Just stay in the center of the runway. Reverse. Spoilers. And auto brake. Decel. If it wasn't copyrighted, I'd be playing uh, Take Me Home Country Road right now because I just want back in my Boeings. <laughs> I love Airbus so much, but jeez. is not bad, I'll take it. That's fine. Ladies and gentlemen, to our leg number 10, welcome to Frankfurt. Hopefully my video stops, it's because my phone's probably run out of memory. We have been recording almost for 54 minutes now, so... Park 
break for a second. Fine, we'll do it your way. One, two, three, four. Off, off. Off, please, thank you. Pedal disconnect. Parking brake off. Fuel to the fire, F9. that the tour's done now this is cool I like this uh, run over to the terminals because you have to go down a hill <laughs> which as we all know in P3D is probably not the, the best thing to do uh, we didn't turn on the rest of our lights because I got blindsided by that goddamn autopilot just kicking out out of nowhere and then not even giving me a warning it was just like I'm gone bro Come to Virtual LH where we'll give you drama. <laughs> okay, let's get to the get to the terminal. Let the passengers off so that they can go be sick now. So, even though I flashed on the screen earlier, I just saw for myself Johnny's landing rate. Not bad for a final rate. I'll explain to him the situation in a moment after we uh, finish up here. Take you guys with me as we bring this bird home. So with this one, we went um, Edinburgh, Munich, to lose, replaced the brakes, and then we took it to um, Cologne, or no, Dusseldorf, and then we left her in Dusseldorf, and then it magically spawned at, um, at Munich, or not Munich, um, Berlin, for us to take back here today, so. Our taxi speed's way too fast, but that's okay. Fire Brigade there to the right, doing a good job, boys. Need to figure out where Johnny went. Sent him a quick text at gate. A38. Very well. Before I text into the back of this guy. Off uh, 36. No. Now I need to figure out where Alpha 36 is. Oh, there's a highway. Oh, tell me we go over a bridge. Neat. I haven't gone this way. I usually deke to the right right away and then go down that hill that takes you by the cargo ramp because I'm usually doing this uh, uh, as Lufthansa Cargo or Aero, Aero Logic. Huh. That's cool. I'm sure that simulated highway plus the FS Labs is yeah about 16... Uh, 14 to 16 frames. Oh, cool, he's going up that hill. I need to check out Frankfurt Airport in real life. Like, that's cool. The airplane goes up a ramp and then over the highway. Neat. But I don't think it's going to simulate the fact that I'm going to slow down here. We're going up hills, 29 knots at the start of the hill. Oh, oh, we're slowing down a bit. Okay, cool. Good, well, we're going to slow down a lot because I don't feel like running into Buddy here. Who is that, anyways? Is that. One, seven, three. That's Johnny! Is the Johnny? Cool. 
cool. Something I just remembered too that I forgot to do. I should shut that off. Oh. It's one of the things that, uh, again, with integration and stuff like that, I hope they uh, they work out. The ability for me to shut off the 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 ability to shut off the squawk whilst I'm in the airplane will actually shut off Iveo. That uh, would be very nice. I think that uh, that does work for bat sim, but uh, we're killing our brakes too by all this doing all this braking. gates here soon. <laughs> We're at one hour now. Foxtrot stands for all the cargo. We're coming up to one of the more popular taxiways for everybody leaving, which is the November. something West Virginia we couldn't have taken a runway that took us further away from the terminal <laughs> 752 on uh, approach there to 25 center we're 25 left it's hard to tell from here off a block coming up here on the left on November 8 just for the LOL. <laughs> Hi Johnny. He's got his broken nose gear right on the center line. And at that point the iPhone became full so my video now is gone. So you'll just have to take the rest of this on voice. Wish list when I go to town next time will be uh, a webcam I can hook up to the computer, I think. Oh, 
Oh, brakes are no longer hot. Shut the fans off. light off that was beaming me in the face that was uh ouchies one of my good buddies is getting married he just invited me to his stag and doe thank you facebook events now I can't for the life of me remember which one I just chose, and that Sky Chef thing just ripped Johnny's plane. R.I.P. If there was a chat, I'd say let's get an F in the chat for Johnny's airplane. Hit Alpha 36. Come on, Johnny, get out of the way. Blow that Lufthansa Technic van right over. It's the tour that will not end. It was a fun tour while that lasted. That 752 is still on approach. God, he's taking a sweet time, eh? That man's gonna rip me, but I don't care. We're gonna pull in. We're gonna pull in and miss by a lot. Oh, we get a key. Here he is. There's the man of the hour. Two, one, stop. And there it is. Parking brake set. Mr. Gary is going to give us a wave. APU bleeds are on. And for the final time, engine two, engine one. Lights come off. Thank you, Gary. Control J. According to the airport itself, we've missed, but uh, we're going to call it that there. Thank you so much, everybody, for joining us on this tour. It was uh, absolutely my pleasure to bring you along with me. Um, hopefully you enjoyed the content, and uh, like I said, be sure to sign up virtuallh.com. Thanks so much, and uh, stay safe.